Hello everybody, this is Timber, and welcome guys to the Igniter SMP server. That's right, we have joined a new server for multiplayer. And uh, I'm actually, I'm really excited for this. Uh, I got the invite, uh, it's been about a week. Maybe a little bit more than that, but uh, it's been kind of a whirlwind. Just trying to uh, get into the group and, and learn everybody's names and stuff. These guys have been up now for a couple of weeks, I think. So I'm a little bit behind. As you can see, there's a lot of builds behind me. A lot of really epic things uh, that we're going to check out today. And I have a cowboy hat. <laughs> so this server is Vanilla Plus. So uh, there's some plugins and stuff, some textures and all kinds of stuff that we're going to dive into as we go. Um, a lot that I don't know about, a lot that I still have to learn. So it's going to be fun. It's going to be a learning experience. But uh, yeah, guys, let's check this out a little bit. Merry Christmas. Welcome to the server. Here's your present. Ooh. <laughs> oh, man, look at this. This is nice. All kinds of goodies. Food. Yeah, I I have hooked you up a little bit. I gave you um, I gave you uh, a full enchanted fortune and silk touch picks iron. So if Ooh. you uh, want to collect your own diamond stuff, you're welcome to. But I thought ah, that'll get you that'll get you started anyway. Absolutely, man. Thank you so much. This is uh, yeah. this is great. There's a bed in there, so you won't you know die. Oh, you gave me some iron too. I was really, uh, I was running yeah. short on anvils, you, so that's good. There you can, go. Uh... <laughs> yeah, just in case you needed to make a few more anvils. Yeah, there yeah, you yeah, go. yeah. Awesome, man. Good. Well, thanks, Vid. I appreciate you. Don't, don't tell Painting Thing that you're running short on anvils because he'll. Uh, oh my gosh! Yeah, he'll provide you a few more. Yeah, there you go. Well, enjoy. Thank you, Vid. Enjoy. Welcome to the server. Thanks. I'll see you later. See you, dude. Well, look at that, guys. We've immediately been hooked up uh, by Vid here with some pretty nice stuff. Some food, some iron, and some pumpkins. There's a little uh, prank going on with anvils. That's why I have so many freaking anvils. But it's all good. Uh, let's take a little uh, look around here, a little walk and talk. Hopefully, you guys don't mind that. Um, I do have some plans later on in the episode. We're going to build a little starter home. Uh, but first, got to find a place to put it. Um, this island here is kind of crammed which is good everybody's kind of on top of one another um it's like a starter village so there's a lot of shops a lot of starter homes and stuff uh, so we're going to check some things out here so igniter's been around for a little bit they're in their third season now and this season like i said it's been up for a couple weeks so we got a lot of catching up to do um this place is kind of cool what is this like a little is this someone's base please touch take it you'll be tickled J stuff. All right. That's cool. Um, yeah. So I got to really get familiar with everybody's bases and stuff because I, I have no idea. I do hear a ton of villagers. Uh, this place is kind of cool. Little conservatory. I see a giant ghast in the sky. This is painting things. Uh, space shuttle. Holy cow. Uh, Dippy. Looks like a lot of stuff over there. Maybe a little fireworks shop. Let's check that out. Wool! Random sheep in the lake. Ooh, we got some shulker boxes for sale. 40 diamonds for one box. Hold up. That's... Oh, we got stuff in here. We have... Hold on. Let me see. What is this? So this is 40 diamonds. That doesn't seem like a bad deal. I have three. Maybe I can bargain. Got a little fireworks shop, it looks like. Yeah, yeah. One diamond a stack for fireworks. 20 diamonds for elytra. Yeah, I got a feeling that this is... I got a feeling I'm going to spend a lot of diamonds here. <laughs> got a feeling I'm going to be shopping around quite a bit. Uh, this looks like a pretty cool spot. What is this? Looks like we have a desert biome. Jungle biome. Cherry tree biome. Coral? Hmm, this is kind of cool. We have a honeycomb shop, bee shop maybe, of some sort. Where's the entrance? Hello? Aha, here we are. And yeah, hello bee, don't sting me. One diamond for two stacks of honeycomb. All right, this is a really cool looking build. I don't know what this is, but it's pretty cool. Looks like a little train or something. I hear redstone. I'm going to step away before I break something. And it's raining. Of course it's raining. It rains everywhere I freaking go. 
Every server, every single player world I play on, it rains. What is this? Slime shop? One diamond per stack of slime balls? Oh yeah, I'm definitely gonna be uh, spending a lot of money here. I'm gonna go broke real quick. I might even spend my three diamonds that I was gifted. Village pet sheep. Please don't eat me. No guarantees. Okay, this thing is massive. <laughs> I mean, you could kind of appreciate it from far away, but once you step up to it, oh my gosh, this is huge. This is really impressive. Do not enter. Hmm. The mud shop. All right. Let's see. One diamond for 64 mud bricks. Pretty good deal. One diamond for two stacks of mud. Oh, yeah. Okay. Very good. Very good. Okay, I think I've seen everything I needed to see for right now. Uh, let's go ahead and try to find us a place to build, a place to hunker down for our starter home. And it looks like we got some empty space up here. Hello, guest. And this feels like it might be a pretty good spot. It's kind of out of the way a little bit. I just want to make sure I'm not building on somebody else's claimed land here, but got a nice view of the uh, space shuttle taking off there. Pretty cool, we got a little village down there we can kind of ransack. Um, I'm sure it's already ransacked, but that's okay. We can ransack it some more. Uh, and yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and claim this spot here. There we go, spot claimed. Now it's time to drop our stuff off and start gathering some stuff. Yo, is that what I think it is? Is that, hold on. I've actually never seen these before yet. That is a camel. Yo. Hey, come here, buddy. I want to check you out. Is he in a boat? No, he's not. It looks like he's in a boat. Oh, look at him go. I had never seen these guys before. Oh, I wish I can, like, capture you. I don't have a lead. I want him. Hey, buddy. How are you? Oh, he's big. He's he's a, he's a big boy. Oh, maybe we'll have to like save these coordinates and come back and get him. Oh, look at him. Oh man, I want him. Yeah, I think I need a saddle for this guy. I don't have one or else I would totally take you home, dude. I'm definitely gonna come back and get you though. Super cool. I do believe that Zero just stopped by to uh, drop us something off. So let's see what we got here. Uh-huh. Ooh, another shulker box. Oh, baby. Welcome, Timber, from Zero. Oh, Fortune 3 pick? That is just what I needed. Thank you, Zero. So sweet. Awesome people here on Igniter. Block of Diamond? Yes, sir. We'll take that. Some cookies. Oh yeah, but I do believe that it is time to build our starter home today, guys, and keep in mind that this is a starter home, okay? It's a starter home in a starter village, so it is going to be somewhat uh, modest. It's definitely not gonna be that. Um, and it's actually gonna be mobile. We're building an RV, and keep in mind, I am a broke boy. I do not have a whole lot of building materials on hand, so I did pick some cheaper building materials, but you know what? I think it's still gonna look good and uh, I'm pretty excited about it. So let's fire up the old time lapse and get to building. Man, I tell you what, who needs a giant space shuttle when you got a life like this? I mean, come on guys, we got a little RV on the frontier, we got a cowboy hat, we're cooking up some pork chops. It is just a beautiful life here on the Igniter S&P. All right guys, so let's check it out here. There's so much to see, it is such a big build. <laughs> uh, it actually only took me like, I don't know, seven or eight minutes to, to build, so not a whole lot to it. But I think it looks pretty cool. 
Um, I put these crops kind of scattered throughout the place. I think it makes the place look a little more complete. And then I added these tire tracks uh, because we, of course, are drifting this bad boy in here, right? Um, but I like that. And then, you know, just kind of starter crops here and there, uh, cactus, pumpkin, you know, wheat, carrots, all that good stuff. Inside, there's not a whole lot to see. I'm going to kind of mess with it off camera a little bit. Um, there's not a whole lot of room here, right? So I have to kind of get creative. I got chests up uh, in the walls with uh, trap doors that kind of hide them. Um, and then I'll probably add like a seat and little decorations, at least as much as I can. Like I said, there's not a whole lot of room. But the main uh, thing is that, you know, I can store my items, I could sleep, I could smelt, I could put a brewing stand here, and it just works. So I kind of like it. <laughs> uh, I think what I'm gonna work on next is just like this pathway here. And I think I'm gonna mix this up with like coarse dirt, just kind of rough it up a little bit. Um, because I would like the other members to kind of know where my starter home is. And there's really not a pathway that leads into this direction. So I might kind of work on that. Uh, that way people can see where I live. Um, even though it's gonna be kind of temporary, right? I mean, this is a starter village. We do have plans to kind of expand. Um, so that's kind of down the road, but this works and I kind of like it. Let me know what you guys think. But that's gonna do it everybody for today's episode of Igniter. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you're as excited as I am for this whole thing. It's gonna be a whole lot of fun. There's gonna be collabs, there's gonna be activity, something that we've kind of been longing for for quite some time when it comes to multiplayer, right? So I am super, super pumped for this. Um, but I need to get busy. I need to get to mining and gathering some resources um, because like I said, I'm a little behind here, so I gotta get ahead. Uh, but that's gonna do it guys. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, please hit the like, please uh, subscribe and all that good stuff. And we'll see you all in the next episode. Bye-bye. Home, home on the range.